everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a decent sized Dollar Tree haul. I went this morning, just got back. I had a list of things I needed to get for our trip to Disney. We're leaving in about a week and a half. It's Tuesday and we have this week and next week and then we go on the Monday. So about a week and a half, it's a little over a week and a half. So, I have a few more things I had to get. Um, I have the kids' CCD is their last class today, so I had wanted to make them, their teachers, a little gift. So, I was able to go to Dollar Tree and get those. I'm really excited. I'll be putting that together today. I might make a video on it. We'll see. And then I just found some other cute things I've been seeing you guys get at Dollar Tree, and I found some, and I can't resist, just like you. So, without further ado, if you want to see what I got at Dollar Tree, stick around. So, I have, I think it's six bags. I spent about $40. I think it was $39 and change, so almost 40 items. Let's get to it. So, in no particular order, my first bag that I have here is a lot of our favorites. I had been looking and looking, but I think what was happening is I kept forgetting to look. It's, I have my big list of things I'm looking for, and I have a budget each time I go. I don't want to spend tons of money because I totally could, and I would forget to look. And they must be hiding down on the bottom because that's where they were today. And this is the one of the items I needed for the um, religion teachers for my children. Um... Some of them will be for them, and some will be for myself. Um, these are the succulents in the little vases. And I'm so excited. So I tried to grab two of each. <clears throat> so it looks like I didn't get another one of these, but that's okay. Um, unless it's in another bag. But So I got two, four, six, eight, ten. I have eleven. Um... Not sure which ones I'll give to the teachers. I will show you what I will do with them. Number two, they had their new summer stuff out. Spring and summer. And for this Saturday, on the 29th, Benjamin makes his first communion. So, <coughs> I'm hoping for the party to be mainly outside. Put up those cute little canopy things. And I needed some holders, covers, I should say, for the food. So this is a food tent, and they had one left in this blue. If they had another, I would have grabbed a second. Um, and it looks like it's a pretty decent size. I might have to go back to the other Dollar Tree and get some more. <clears throat> I wanted to get me and Emma, these two are tangled, another loofah for just the Disney trip, and... Through the week, me and Emma use it and then um, just leave it there for the trash. Because these are, you know, not the greatest. And that way, not having to worry about, um, you know, it being wet and, and more heavy, I'll just leave it there. So I have that. And then at the checkout, I've seen these before. And I was like, let me get these. These are the cutest ones, the watermelon and the strawberry. And if you haven't seen these, these are... A bag, um, what do they call them? An expandable bag, um, and they're attached to this, so it's all together, and then you just put it back in here. So I was just going to get one. I grabbed the strawberry, and then I'm like, you know what, let me have two. Um, I'll probably put in my purse and my carry-on for the Disney in case we need a bag, say, to put things that we buy. We'll have a little bag, and then it'll just be in my purse every other day after the trip. Great thing to have. In the um, travel little section of, you know, toothpaste and lotions and deodorants, I said, well, I saw this and I, I just got a big package of three from BJ's, but instead of taking the big ones, and that way I can have this packed like today in the suitcase, I'll have, and I use Secret, so... I'll just have this for the week, and again, I'll probably use it and maybe just toss it there at the hotel, um, even if I didn't finish it up. We'll see. Um, 
And then I got this because I was just thinking yesterday and today, um, we all have different body lotions normally here at home, but if we could have even just the guy one for like Daddy and Sebastian, and then I'll get one other one for me and the other kids, and then I want to have a lotion that can fit in the purse. So I saw this, and I'll just take this. It will be good. This here is impossible to do with the um, religion teachers. If not, I wanted them anyway in the blue, like, kind of like a light blue teal. And then just the white diamond wraps. You get six feet on each. All right, next bag, bag number three. Is just got two heavy items that when I saw them, this was my first time seeing them there. Um, I said, let me grab two, one for my bathroom and one for the kitchen. I'm down to, like, no more hand soap after what we're using now currently. And these, I figured, were such a nice container. I can refill them. Um, it's an aloe and chamomile cream soap. Don't know how I'll like it. It looks kind of watery, but... We'll try it out, see how it pumps up and, and works. I think that's a nice container to have. So we'll try those. <clears throat> Next bag, bag four. Again, just a couple items. They're pretty heavy. This is to go with the religion teacher um, gifts, the stones in white. I was going to do the, um, the glass beads filler, but then I was like, oh, I see these, and I think this will look nice with the containers that I'm going to use. Wait until you see. So I have those. Okay, so these are for the religion teachers. I was planning on just getting a white mug. Um, I saw it on Pinterest, but when I saw this beautiful... Um, gosh, what color blue would you say it is? It's hard because you've got my bed colors here. It's, that's a pretty true color. Very pretty. I got three of them. Ben has one teacher and Emma has kind of two because it's a mom and a daughter who's in high school. And I know them well from being in Girl Scouts. I had the older daughter um, and now this is the younger daughter. And, um, yep, so Emma gets to see her in Girl Scouts, the daughter, um, she's one of the older Girl Scouts in town, so it's kind of nice, and I figured I'll make one for her, I think she'll appreciate it. And then, in the air freshener aisle and automotive, I found these. This is new to me, the Aruba Blue Breeze, and it looks like you hang it from the mirror so that'll be really cute i'm gonna put that in my car probably today and then there's this one and my husband wants it again aruba blue breeze air freshener it clicks onto the vents and it's got a sun and um flip-flops really cute <clears throat> and got those and then my last bag uh, my husband mentioned to me yesterday, I think it was, and I said, yes, yes, I'm planning on doing that, so don't worry. And so I had that in my head, um, being at Dollar Tree, and I wanted to get a container for a little first aid kit to so get all our Band-Aids and our Advil, um, and I probably, and then I want to put, like, I got the little um, Advil from Dollar Tree last time, and I don't know which one I'll use. We're going to be taking... Um, I have a small purse, and then Steven's going to carry a backpack. So I am was hoping for this one, but then I'm like, I don't know if that's big enough, and I don't know if this is too big. Um, but really, in his backpack, we're not going to have much else. We're going to have the ponchos, the kids' um, autograph books, and then um, a couple of other things. So um, this would work, because that'll be better. I'm probably going to get um, medicines in there. So along with that, I was thinking of this, and being these two, I'm hoping to work for the kids' liquid medicines. I would like to take some Motrin, 
children's Motrin and some other maybe either allergy or cold medicine. Being they're not sick now, but just in case they do, um, at least to have some on hand. Because we've had that the first trip we took when Ben was 11 months old. He left that morning with a horrible temp and a cold. And we had to buy medicine there. And in the hotel, it was outrageously priced. So I want to have those. And then this one, Emma and I are going to need a spray gel for our hair. Me, so that way if it gets droopy in the humidity, I can spray a little bit of gel and hopefully that'll perk it back up so I can look decent. And for Emma, she has such thinning hair, thin hair that if I don't put gel on it when I do it in the morning, it's just going to come apart in a mess. So that way, again, if through the day, if I have to refix it, um, I'll have it in this, um, in my purse. That'll fit the little purse that I have. So I might have to go back and get another one, medicines in another spray bottle. That would be great, but maybe not. Then at checkout, and I've seen this before, and today it hit me because the kids got Disney-themed um, suitcases for Christmas from my parents. Emma's got a Minnie Mouse one. It's adorable. It's red with the polka dots. And the boys have Star Wars ones. So I just have a plain um, suitcase. And I want to be able to... The only time we're going to have to look for it is coming home um, back here in the state. Um, and just to see it cute once I get it and have it for the week. This is just a little clip-on. She's basically just like a um, clothy felt material to have dangling on there. And really, if I lose it, if it gets mixed up, um, it's only a dollar. So that's really cute. And also at checkout, on a bottom shelf, I saw the emoji stuff. So for right now, I only grabbed a few. I love this one because it's the like really pretty colors. Um, and it's cute. It's not a magnet, but... Really cute. I then saw this one, which is a soft cover journal. And I thought it was cute because it's got, like, the emoji guys. But a one in which is also emojis. The hamburger, the fries. Really cute. The little cactus. And the cute little characters on both sides. That's cute. And then I got this memo pad. Emma loves the one with the hearts and then the glasses. So I got this one. And then I got the stickers. Which these are, I think, a new set. Has over 500. Um, I've gotten some before at Dollar Tree. So, and I do use them in my planner. So. My daughter's going to like this one. I think we're having for next April a unicorn party for her. That's what she says. And this is the back one. Then we got smaller one. See, like, even just to have, like, a cake and some hearts, you know, you'll use those. And then who knows with, like, different emotions that you're having about something that happens. <coughs> and some trucks, if anything happened, you can mock those down. So that concludes my Dollar Tree haul. Um, I think what I'll just do is just explain to you at this end of this video. So if you want to stick around... Ow, to see how I'm making the teacher gifts with the succulents stick around. Okay, so the plan is to take the mug, take the rock filler, fill it up with the rock filler, and then put in, I'm thinking, two succulents on a mug, um, and then I'm going to have a tag, um, and that's where i got to see what it's supposed to say tag that I know I have a bunch of that I've gotten from Dollar Tree. Um, I'm going to write, thank you for helping me grow in God's love and growing a plant, even though it's going to be the fake succulent. That way they don't have to worry about making it die and they'll always have it to remember, you know, the children. So that will be it and they will bring those today. And then if they wanted to, they could also take it out if they wanted to have the mug. But I'm thinking they'll keep it and I think it'll look cute. They could put that in the kitchen. And I might have to make one for myself. So thank you guys so much for watching today. 
Um, don't forget to hit that red button down below to join our family. And as always, enjoy the glitter.